Canva is a free-to-use graphic design website that can substitute for paid programs like Adobe Photoshop. It all runs in your browser or mobile app, so there's no need to download more software for your computer. If you're not really a graphic designer, need to do something fast, or just need some inspiration, Canva is a great tool for making things like photo quotes. To start, log into Canva or create an account. The first thing you want to do is create your canvas. Since a photo quote can really be any dimensions you want it to be, picking your sizing may be the hardest part of the whole project. Click on Create a Design and you'll be prompted to choose custom dimensions or to create based off of a sizing template. This is great if you want to post to Instagram or another platform that relies on exact dimensions, but in this case we're going to type quote into the search bar and select the quote social graphic template. This will open up our canvas and we'll actually see a variety of templates to choose from. If you don't want the hassle of making a design from scratch, this is the place to start. Choose from a ton of templates that encompass various styles and moods. The text and imagery will match nicely in these templates and all you'll need to do is replace the sample text with whatever you want to say. If you have a specific photo in mind, just go straight to the Upload tab and select your image. Resize it so it fills the canvas. If you don't have an image in mind, you can click on the Photos tab and select from one of Canva's free images. Or go to the Background tab and pick a solid color or texture from Canva's library. Sometimes these more simple backdrops are easier to work with when using large amounts of text because it prevents the image and text from getting muddled together. Next, click on the Text tab. You can certainly pick your own fonts if you have something in mind. If you select Heading, Subheading, or Body Text, Canva will insert some pre-formatted text for you. From there, you can change the font type, style, and color. There are also a number of great font combinations that are guaranteed to look good together. The layouts are also preset, so if you're not a graphic designer by trade, these font templates will help you not only with style choices, but also with word arrangement. The next bit is fairly subjective, so trust your gut here. Make sure the font, the quote, and the background image all match up together. For example, you probably won't pair a quote from Hulk Hogan with a flowery cursive font against a background of the ocean. At least not in most cases. Make sure everything feels natural and like all of the elements belong together. By now you should have an attractive photo quote. The project is automatically saved to your account, so you'll be able to come back and make more images in this style later. To save the image, click on the download button in the top right corner. This will save the image to your device and you can upload it to your favorite social media platform from there. Hopefully this video helps you get more comfortable with Canva. Let us know in the comments what quote you want to put on a social media image. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. And if you're looking for professional LUTs, Lightroom desktop and mobile presets, Premiere Pro templates, and more photo and video education, visit filtergrade.com today.